I come from a country like Colombia. People, when they think about Colombia, they think about coffee, right? Yeah, that's oof. And we have a very delicious, tasty coffee that I always recommend, obviously. But when you look at the cultural economy, the orange economy, it's larger than the coffee economy. The orange economy in Colombia is larger than mining. And it's larger than many uh, commodities that we know of. Why? Because people acknowledge that when you look at heritage, museums, patrimony, heritage sites, and you combine it with the arts, with cre functional creations, and with media, that is almost 3.5% of our GDP and growing. But it doesn't happen overnight, and it doesn't happen just in a, in a Sylvester way. It happens because when you combine the right incentives and you tell, for example, the movie industry, come here, you'll get a rebate, and you start generating jobs within that economy, the value triggers immediately. That's why one of the fastest growing sectors in Colombia and that was crucial in the economic recovery in a post-pandemic world was the orange economy. And that's why, for example, with the incentives that we created, we passed from an average $20 million investment in the movies and series production to more than $300 million. So imagine if a country like Belize combines the heritage of these amazing sites with such a beautiful patrimony, of this amazing green that you have in land that can be beautiful for movie production, and then you combine it with this amazing coral reefs and this beautiful ocean sites and landscapes, yeah. you can make this country one of the most interesting markets for movie production in Latin America.